First up on today's telly box, Corrie bosses are on high alert after it emerged that some naughty bods are planning to sabotage next week's live episode. It's thought that their plans to ruin the special show next Thursday include setting off industrial fireworks, including rockets in a park about 100 yards away, sounding their horns in adjacent roads to the Granada set, and revving motorbike engines when the filming is going on. And if reports are true, tensions are already high as the cast prepare for the big night. It's understood that one big name in the show was told off after the first get-together when he stumbled through his words. And rapper Agro Santos became the next celeb to be booted out the jungle. The 22-year-old, who landed in the bottom two alongside Playboy model Kayla Collins, left the show in good spirits. Everybody's had different experiences and it's, and it's helped me to mature as a person. That's one thing I can say from being here. I definitely feel I've matured and I'm ready oh, really? to carry on and take it to the next step. And it's part for, partly to do with the fact that a lot of people are much older and wiser. A mature Agro was greeted by his mum. And finally, Stacey Solomon last night revealed that she didn't get on with some of her fellow X Factor lot last year. I used to sing. love Deadwood. Yeah. Got, they were like my really close friends. Right, but, and some people yeah. were a bit mean to them because they thought they didn't deserve to be there. I don't think it's fair to make a judgment of anyone's character in that situation. Same as in here. I don't honestly think I can make a judgment of any of your characters properly because I'm not in a normal situation. We love Stacey. Stacey to win. That's your lot. See ya.